This is our 2018 recap. And the question of the video is what can happen in a year? My name is Taylor, this is Kale. We are KT9 and we are about three words, making money online. If you are down for that, why don't you go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you can be around because we are going into 2019 after this 2018 recap. Guns a blazing, guns -a -blazin'. ready to go, ready to kick ass and take names, okay? Yep. So, guys, this video is not about like, hey, Kale and I are badasses, like, look at us, like us bragging, okay? What this video is, is really what that first question is, is what can happen in a year? Think about where you are at right now, and then think about where you can be at the end of 2019. Guys, if you'd have told us where we were gonna be at right now in January, what would you have said? I would have said you're insane, and what the, what the hell are you I don't think, like, it, it, it exceeded our expectations, but it's because we did a couple things that we're gonna go over in this video, okay? So starting off in January of 2018, right? We had been going with our Amazon FBA business for a couple of months, and January is when it really started booming. January is when we hit 80,000 plus per month in revenue, and we've maintained that since then, okay? And it has just been killing it. It's what really catapulted us in. That's how we started, but we didn't like start January 1st with that. That was like at the end of January, right? And what did we decide to do from there? We decided to not take that money and buy cool cars and go and spend all of it. We decided to reinvest. That's what we decided to do with it. We decided to reinvest and go and start other companies, go and start other things, because we didn't want to just sit here and get to the end of 2018 and be like, oh, we wasted that money. Ah, oh, what did we do? What happened, right? So the first company that we started was Honey Badger Boost, okay? We started Honey Badger Boost, and what Honey Badger Boost is, is a product photography, listing optimization, product pick list, all found and done by us or by people that we have personally trained based off of our experience, based off what we did. And we went and started Honey Badger Boost for one very specific reason, okay? We looked at our Amazon business and we said, hey, what are we paying other people to do for us right now? If we are willing to pay for it, then other people will be willing to pay us for it. So we started Honey Badger Boost and that is obviously still going, it's still happening, but that was one of the first things that we started. The other thing that started right then and there was our YouTube channel. Okay, so we did Honey Badger Boost. Then we went and we started the YouTube channel. You can go back, you can see our first couple of videos. They were trash. We had bad cameras, we had bad lighting, we had bad audio, and we Hold had- Hold on a second, I gotta catch up! We had, you have to catch up. I'm just telling a story, bro. I'm just telling a story. We were trash, okay? We've gotten better, hopefully. I hope that we've gotten better. But we started the YouTube channel, which is where you're at right now, KT9. It's been a blast. Uh, sometimes it's been stressful coming up with content. There were a couple months where we posted daily. That is hard. Come up with content, film it, get all the editing done, get everything done. Now what we're doing is we're basically concentrating on doing less videos per week, but higher quality. But we started YouTube in February as well, okay? The next thing that we started after KT9, and really it's kind of what helped us catapult this next business is what YouTube did, is we started Nine University, okay? So, Nine University is an Amazon FBA course. It's what it started at, and basically what it was is, is we had had a lot of success with our Amazon business. We had been posting on Facebook, we had been doing some things, we had been having a lot of people ask us questions on Facebook, ask us questions on our YouTube channel about Amazon. So instead of asking the same question every single day, we wanted to create a course that just answered those questions for people that was in one place that people could just go to, okay? That is how Nine University was born, and that was in April. Kel, how did you feel in April when we started Nine University? I thought that no one would buy it. I thought that, I didn't know if it would work. Yep. I thought that I was just gonna put out some videos just like we kinda do on YouTube, and then maybe, hopefully some people would watch them and get benefit from them. But right. the thing that has happened since has been shocking. It's been incredible, and that's what the rest of this video is about, okay? Yeah. So right after that, come about the end of April, May, June time frame, that is when Kale actually quit his job. Yeah. It's when Kale quit his nine to five job, got out of that. That was at the very beginning of 9U. I think at that point in time, we literally had like maybe 10 to 15 students, like maybe. Kel quit his job solely based off our Amazon FBA business because honestly, it was like a couple days before anybody bought it. And then our first student, Christian, he came in, 
and bought 9U and it was crazy, but that was literally, did not help Kale quit his job, right? That was Amazon. But he quit his job and then we actually started hiring other employees too, right? We hired our office manager, her name is Emily, she's great. Um, a little bit after that, we ended up hiring my brother Thomas, who's come in and done a whole bunch of stuff with Honey Badger Boost, come in and help us with video editing, all that stuff, okay? So after all that was done, we came out with the second product from Nine University, which was our Facebook ads course. Because with these employees, with Kel so being able to quit his job, all that kind of stuff, it freed up our time to go and look at a couple different things. And all of this had started because we had started doing Facebook ads for our own business. We had discovered, hey, we need to do Facebook ads for Nine U. We need Facebook ads to help us sell our Amazon products. We learned how to do it and then created a course on Facebook ads. I have no idea how to draw Facebook ads other than the fact that the best thing about them is when you put in a dollar over here, yeah. you get to track it and see it. You literally just watch it for yeah. a few dollars over here. Wow. And then what we've learned, I think, the coolest part of the thing we've learned about the Facebook ads over this time that we never knew and like we just didn't just had no idea is that all this information in the middle, like how to make this gap better. How to figure out how to turn one dollar into three dollars? How to make one dollar turn into five dollars? It was something we we had no knowledge right. of. We could just turn into something simple. So exactly. Yeah. So we had this come out, guys. This is about the time where we started seeing we started seeing some student success stories. Yep. So we look back in like June, August. That's when Nick joined the group. That's when we first started talking to people like Harry and Gary who were really pushing it forward. I know that's when Joshua Mallon was really starting to put some things forward. A couple of our students, you may have heard their names before. But at this point in time, we started to get some student success. Guys, we also learned about affiliate marketing. And here's how we learned about affiliate marketing. Yes, we had heard of it before. Yes, we had seen the links. Yes, we had, we had done all this. And we had actually been putting affiliate links on our YouTube videos for like months. But we were just putting them there. We didn't do anything. And then one day we literally went to a, one of the links and we went and signed in. And we had like $6,000 sitting there. Six grand just like video. No. And so we were like, okay, we need to get on this affiliate marketing game, okay? And that is about the time when we came out with an affiliate marketing program for Nine University. Yeah, yeah. We started getting into affiliate marketing more ourselves. We started doing it more, started getting more links, started doing all that stuff. I'm saying a lot of words, and Kayla's having a really hard time to keep up. Plus, I feel like this is hard to draw. It's all, I'm basically just writing what you're saying. <laughs> right, but is it entertaining? Do you like this kind of video? If not, I don't need to draw anymore. If so, we'll keep doing them, so comment below. But here's the thing, guys. Affiliate marketing is cool because you get a little army of people. Imagine, like, if I could draw a lot faster, imagine, like, a hundred of these people selling your product. Right. So we had this one product, and then we got, ooh, look at this box. I'm gonna make this box. Okay. Okay. Oh, check. What? What? A hundred people sold this, and that made this go through the roof. Right. And we realized how profitable it was just from us posting links on YouTube videos, yeah. stuff like that. Knew we wanted to do it for our own products, but also continue to do it for other people's products because yeah. we could make good money, okay? Yep. Um, around this time, we were working on one project that I'm going to talk about in a second. We came out with a third addition to Nine University, which was the Make Money Online course. I love this course. I love everything about it, and here's why. Because the Facebook Ads course and the Amazon FBA courses, those are around $1,000, okay? This Make Money Online course is $100. It's got 100 videos in it. It's literally a dollar per video, and it walks everyone through, like, everything. It's got 100 videos. It's, it's only $97. It's $97, it's cheap, but it bolts from this, and it's it's not anything complicated, it's not anything crazy, but guys, it helps people, and it's an incredible nope. value, and that's why we put it out, and I love the fact that we put it out. It's so good. It's such a good opportunity, guys. You can just get, throw down $97, make your money back from that, and then take that to the next level. It's, literally, it's guaranteed money. Exactly, so after that course came out, our next two products came out. They came out on the same day, and they are 9U 2.0. Give me a 2.0 kale. Do you guys remember launch week? Launch week was I insane. Mean, holy crap, guys. Launch week was so cool. We came out with B. B I'm just going to put a B9 here. Yep. And I'm going to put a 2.0 here, guys. Yep. I don't know how to illustrate this. All I'm doing is writing words on this notepad. But Boost 9 is a software company that me and Taylor started, which was fantastic, which took a lot of development and time. Did. Like, if you would have thought to yourself at the beginning of 2018, 
we would develop and release our own software. That's been like a dream of mine, but I didn't think it would be possible for yeah. like years and years, and then it happened this year. It's, if, if you can take one thing away from this video, is that you can learn how to do anything. Right. Like we had no knowledge of software, no knowledge of building software. Me in particular, I mean, Taylor can write like a, a line of code. I barely can get on Google. You know, like I'm not that great it's at true. a computer. And so like the fact that we were able to do that, guys, is shocking. And then 2.0. Right. The fact that we were able to launch the second version of our course Correct. in the same year. Updated, new videos, brought tons more content, Crazy. tons more value to our students. Yep. If you are one of our students, we love you. We love you Thank so you. Much. You are incredible. We can't wait to see what you do. I know uh, what to draw for that. Yeah? Oh, just a big heart. That's what I feel for you. Exactly. <laughs> and 2018 has been an incredible year. We have almost 500 students. It's literally incredible. It's crazy. But after 92.0 and Boost 9 came out, the next was like a mini launch and it was for merch. Ooh. So we have t-shirts. We actually, neither one of us are actually wearing any of our we merch said right that now. We would wear the merch in every video and we right. always forget. Right. I literally don't think I have any clean because I wear it I every wear day. It all Except actually, for when we're recording this video. Super yeah, it is. Yeah. But we came out with merch, and that was like that was more as a fun thing, and that was a thing for the non fam. Okay, if you are part of the non fam, you know what that means. It's not just a clothing line. It's not just a hashtag. It is a way of life, and that sounds cheesy. Yep. Sounds cliche, but I don't care. Okay, that's what it is. Okay. I just wrote one thing here that represents the non family guys. It's this one word. It's called doers. Nine family are the people that stop talking and they actually do things. We said when we released the merchandise line that you're not allowed to buy it if you're not going to go out and do something in 2019 and 2020, whenever you're watching this video, because we did a lot of stuff this year. Yep. A lot of crap. And, and if you don't see that and actually take action, right. then you're not really a part of this family that we've tried to Correct. Do. Absolutely. So when we look back and we do our recap of 2018, right, yep. we have started four companies. From just all crazy. of the companies outside of Amazon FBA, we have made a net profit of over $1 million from yep. those four companies. After our expenses, after office, after salaries, a million dollars profit, okay? Just writing down that six zeros kind of makes me freak Right. Out. And if, you are, if you're sitting at home and you're thinking to yourself, wow, those guys had a great year. They did something super special. We made so many mistakes. We sucked so much. This is such a, a an almost like a uh, miss the mark number. Dude, if we had started, the, like if we had started 2018, not with all the money, yeah. but with the knowledge that we have right oh now. Gosh. That's that's what I was trying to say. It would have been a, a 50 million dollar year. If you could if you could invest in knowledge quicker than we invested in knowledge, you could turn this year double triple. It's incredible, year. right? From Amazon FBA. Guys, we've been, we've explained why we can't, why we don't share stuff with our Amazon FBA business. I will say it's in the hundreds of thousands of dollars, somewhere around four hundred to five hundred thousand dollars. Okay, we have started the YouTube channel and gotten to eleven, over eleven thousand subscribers at the time of filming this. Yep. Okay, and guys, we have we have plans for the future. Literally earlier today, Kale and I sat in a room that's right there and had this crazy whiteboard with all these diagrams and writing and arrows on it about. Oh, Flash it on the screen for 0.1 seconds. Boop! No, people are gonna freeze it and then go and see all our business secrets. What Whatever. <laughs> Planned out everything for like the next couple months. We have some ideas for like six months down the road. Yeah. We have our goals for 2019 set. But guys, this was our 2018 recap. It's what we did. I don't know. You can do whatever you're doing. I'm just kind of talking. We're only going to last for about 10 more seconds. So, Okay, if you have 10 seconds, what should you watch? Well, it's 2019 now, okay? So what you should watch is this video that I'm putting over here on the side of the screen. This video is the beginning of a playlist. This is a playlist breaking down our favorite way to make money online, which is Amazon FBA. Start here, work your way down the playlist, and learn what we should have learned quicker than we learned it. You're going to have an amazing million dollar 2019. This guy's a genius. See you in the next one.